Good afternoon friends, uh, welcome to the mid market update uh, from the advisory desk. Uh, today the market opened in the green uh, after like about a two or a couple of sessions on the downtrend. Uh, it rebounded in early trade uh, because of the also strong Asian indices like uh, Hang Seng, Nikkei also trading up. Uh, now index which has lost 350 points uh, since about Friday uh, rose about 160 points in the morning and about right now it's sitting about 150 odd points uh, at 18,870-880. Uh, friends meanwhile uh, there are a couple of uh, uh, news uh, and updates that I would like to convey. Uh, some oral stocks were under pressure after uh, the government has uh, cut the export uh, duty drawback uh, which they are supposed to get. It was 5.5 percent and it has cut back to 2 percent. Uh, now this duty drawback uh, which has been reduced, uh, it will affect the companies, uh, basically the auto companies which export uh, from India to other foreign locations. Uh, Bajaj Auto was affected, it fell 2 percent. TVS Motors declined 1.2 percent. Uh, Ashok Leland was down another 1 percent. Uh, so these companies would be affected uh, by the decision of the uh, finance ministry uh, to cut down on the duty drawback. Uh, so that's the uh, news uh, which is into the focus right now and has uh, some analysts worried about the uh, prospects of this uh, export oriented companies like auto companies. Uh, uh, otherwise, Tata Motors, ICICI Bank, Axis Bank, l a uh, couple of uh, real estate stocks uh, and the Lupin have gained in early trade. Uh, they have kind of bounced back for some after booking some profit in the previous sessions. Uh, um, also the country's largest uh, private sector bank, ICICI Bank is up almost by 2%. Uh, SBI is up by nearly 1 percent. Uh, uh, coming back to the IT uh, stocks, uh, Infosys uh, is uh, pretty doing good. Uh, even uh, TCS is have marginally gained today. Um, focus now shifts to again uh, Forex. Uh, yesterday the Nifty uh, almost uh, bar declined because of uh, the selling pressure and the European debt crisis. Uh, but uh, afterwards when the market closed uh, in the uh, European uh, ECB has declared 650 billion dollars of funds more to the uh, European uh, crisis uh, funds. So that's why uh, this is with a cushion to the Indian markets. Uh, as in when uh, the Greece or any country would be needing funds, uh, they would be utilizing from that. So for now uh, the European debt crisis uh, situation won't be worsening going forward. Even the US data came out to be good. Uh, so that's one point to cheer out there for the world markets that the country's uh, economic system is not that bad. Uh, friends, uh, that's all the news we have uh, till now. Uh, we'll get back to you with more updates in the post market. Thank you.